Salutation, Nick Rinkies. Welcome back to another video, and today we are continuing Monster Prom. I'm first. Yeah, you actually have to get some points with Damien now. I, I, do, do you think I'm not trying? Kiss counter. <laughs> Kisses always solve everything. What are you doing? You mess with me, and then you try to sit at my table? Go away and get ready to die, fuckhead. You just eat in the corner in silence. Will you die soon? Who knows? Meanwhile, nothing else happens. And if you think this is unfair, next time don't try to sit at at the table of a person who has experienced his desire to murder you. Who has expressed. Ex sure. Totally not a smart move. Oh. Wait, did you just ruin all your chances with him? Yeah. Aww. He doesn't like me. Aww. Baby, I like you. Yeah. I like you a lot. Yeah. You can say I love you. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, there, there's your boyfriend, Scott. Yeah. You approach Scott and Polly's table to find them crouched behind a pile of jelly desserts, plotting. Oh, yep, no, that's Aaron. <clears throat> Thank Brosive you're here, bro. Come on, join our huddle. Oh. Maybe you're curious about our huge pile of jelly jam, gelatin, Gelat gelatinous, gelatinous dessert cups. Well, wonder no more. You're go, you're going for the jelly prize. Oh, we're going for the jelly prize. Yeah, we're gonna win it. If we collect the foil cover of a hundred jelly desserts, we will be the lucky winners of one free jelly dessert. Ah! Damn. But right now we're stuck. We only got 99, but that means we need, we need one more. Scott, we need one more. We need one more. You give them your jelly dessert, but you already threw it at a bird, per, uh, bird person you hate. <laughs> Guess you got to make a choice. Uh, st uh, make like a puppy dog and beg. All things are sweeter than you through pity. Um, I'd steal it. But isn't stealing wrong? No, Scott. That's a myth. Like hangovers and the afterlife. But if the afterlife isn't real, then why are you a ghost? There's no time for metaphoric... Meta metaphysics. Meta metaphysics, Scott. We've got a heist to plan. No! Coach says stealing is wrong, unless you are stealing a ball, or a base, or a victory from the jaws of defeat... Actually, it seems like sports mostly are about stealing. Well, that settles it. Time for stealing! One fake bus, one real woolly mammoth, and a brutal running gun battle later, you finally secure one illicit illicit Ill 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 uh, jelly cup, my bad. Which it's you turn in it's along with your 99 other jelly cups for one free jelly cup. It's illicit. Thank you. Mm. Scott is too upset by all the violence, so you split your free jelly cup with Polly. Worth it! <laughs> Aww. Everybody chooses an object. Say your choice out loud to the rest of the players before clicking. Coca Cola. Bottle. <laughs> A moist towelette. Oh, fun. Player orders decide based on how useful the selected object would be as your only belonging on a deserted island. I win. Yeah, you win. Actually, 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 Coca-Cola can be used as a food source because it does fill you up. Yeah, but a moist towelette. What are you going to use that for? Cooling yourself. <laughs> cleaning yourself on the island so There's... you don't reek for when the rescue party comes. <laughs> on the island, there would be like an ocean or some sort Babe, of lake. let's just give me this one. I haven't been first in forever. Okay, fine. You won by a fluke. I can admit that because I had the best baby ever. Aww. <gasps> Alright, it's my turn. I get kisses. I you get all the kisses. That day during recess, you start a half-hour rave that goes full crazy. You spot Joanne, the small magical Latino cat who sings a bit sad. He explains to you that he's worried about, uh, um, uh, worried people are, are so used to calling him Juan. Joanne, the small magical Latino cat. Now everyone defines him only by his size, magic, magicality, and, th and species. He's more than that. You correct him. 
You don't see him in such simplistic terms and, co and convenient definitions. It's just that there are 23 other difficult Joans in the school, uh, so adding all that to his name is quite necessary. You tell him that you'll never forget about him and the crazy adventures you both lived together in Monster Prom's prequel, Monster Middle School. Wait, there's another... No, there's a sequel, but... It's oh. literally on the main menu. I'll, we'll show you it after the game. We have a great time remembering. No, you're not. You're beautiful. Mm -hmm. And smart Aww. and talented and amazing. So are you, Libby. Thank <laughs> you. You have a great time remembering those crazy stories. You game plus two fun. But none of that matters. You're late to meet Polly for our more party experiments. <laughs> All right, our research. Oh, sorry. Oh, I always do that! All right, our research is progressing well so far. But we've got a very limited sample size. We need to know that we can make any party the best, not just some parties. So tomorrow morning, we're going to crash a funeral. Oh, fuck, no. <laughs> if we can make that fun, we can make anything fun. So brainstorm time. How can we put the fun back in funeral? <laughs> Possess the body of the deceased, bringing him back for one last party. Yes. Yeah. Yes! <laughs> Later that night. Woo! That was awesome! I was totally inside that dude. That's what she said. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and then when... And then when they were like, does anyone else want to say a few words? <laughs> I was all... Oh, oh me! <laughs> <laughs> they totally freaked out. <laughs> and then I was like, let's turn this funeral into a wedding. And I got married to 11 people. Damn. Who are, who are all windows now because I left that dude in a heap on the <laughs> dance floor. But whatever, wedding rules. <laughs> hey, Nick Rick. Uh, you know what? I think we're getting really close uh, to the true formula for a rad party. You're the best scientist partner I've ever had. Sorry, the best one I've ever had is this beautiful person right here. <laughs> Kiss counter. <laughs> Alright. You guess she hasn't had lots of science partners. You doubt she even knows the real definition of science, but she's just too happy for you to correct her now. <laughs> Come on, the night's still young. Let's go turn an all-night uh, laundromat into an epic grave. Those washing machines don't know what hit them. <laughs> you gain plus two creativity and plus one fun. Oh, right. shit. I am drowning in the charm and fun. I mean, boldness and fun. That day, you experience... That day, an epic dodgeball match takes place. Shush. I wasn't going to say anything. Uh-huh. I, I heard your lips move like... <laughs> Everything is easily lost, but you deliver an inspirational speech that f fuels your team's experience. <laughs> Leading to a spectacular comeback. You're clearly a born natural leader. A natural born leader. <laughs> I'm just looking at Rob. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You gain plus suit charm. Afterwards, Damon comes up and punches you affectionately in the shoulder. Wait, you might still have a chance. Hey, asshole, go to hell. Like, literally, my house is in hell, and I'm inviting you over. Don't read too much into it. Uh, okay. Only one problem in order to get there, you kind of got to damn your immortal soul. So, how about it? What crimes against God and man will you commit so we can hang out? <gasps> oh, I think I'm already damned. Looking into your eyes feels so good. It must be a sin. I'll run over a bunch of nuns with the one more. I think I like that one. The, that one. This one? Yeah. Okay. Fuck! Sorry, babe. Hey, hey, I'm sorry. <laughs> Been there, done that, bought the t-shirt, and did it again. Got the t-shirt covered in nun's blood. It just, I didn't know he likes puns. He does he looks like a fucking asshole. 
Had to buy another t-shirt. I'm sorry, babe. That was my fault. Is that seriously the most creative way you could um, come up with to, ha what to kill <laughs> I'm talking. What about a giant magnifying glass? Plague of centipedes. Rice somehow. Come on, use your imagination. I can't believe I even invited a loser like you to my sweet hell house. Dejected, you go out and uh, hunting uh, Get Dejected, you go out nun hunting anyway. But nut nunting just <laughs> isn't the same without love and to motivate it. You lose two charm and one money for bail. Oh, the monster. Oh, wait, I have to ask now? Yeah. Oh, okay, so this is the last episode. Yeah. Oh. I'm asking, I'll ask Polly. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna go ballsy with it. I don't care. Yeah. Hey, noob. <laughs> That's all he said. <laughs> you finally pluck up your courage to ask your beloved to go to the monster prom with you. No, it wasn't. Prom with you? Stupid. stupid I'm reading. Oh. Prom with you? Stupid fuck. <laughs> I need spice in my life. And if you were spice, you would be. Um. Hmm. Some fucking bland spice. What a loser. What a loser. After that, you were forced to abandon your home and join the underground society of sad people who couldn't get a date for Monster Prom. Which is a fancy way of saying you had to live the rest of your life in the fucking sewers. Gross. Hey. hey. I get, I I get it, this. I, I get this hottie. So. I get this beautiful person. I I, I'm okay care. with this hottie. I don't really care about the other hottie. Oh. He's, he's, not, he's not that hot. Yeah, I'm literally. I have a higher temperature than normal. What? Prom? Of course! Prom night will be an. <laughs> another per perfect opportunity. <laughs> will be another perfect appro so. opportunity to conduct our experiment. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I did it! I just realized. <laughs> just clicked in. <laughs> Exper. Can you move the mouse? Experiment. <laughs> 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 Can you move your mouse for a second? I have a problem. Really. <laughs> so clever of you. That's why you're the best. That's why you're the best science partner. <laughs> That's not what you meant, but sure, why not? Sooner than expected, prom night is here, and the two of you are finally ready to crack the ultimate party formula. You free some wild animals, you do lots of ecstasy, you awaken the dead, you even dance, uh, do the dance of joy. Everything is perfect. You will you feel floaty and full of energy. See beautiful shiny lights and you feel connected with everyone. Obviously most of that is thanks to the ecstasy, but still. You feel like you've conquered the night and put a flag with your names at the peak of it, life itself. The dawn comes, by now you're on a hill by the sea watching the sun slowly coming up. No idea how you got there, but who cares? You're at peace watching the gentle tide of morning when you realize Polly has never ha um, uh, has her hand over yours. She looks at you. You know what, Nick Rick? This might be this might be the Molly talking, but I think I finally got it. All these parties have been wildly different, yet all of them have been the very best. I've put a lot of thought into it, and I can only think of one thing they all had in common. I think the formula to a perfect party must be sharing it with the right person, with the right people. You don't answer. You just hold her hand as you spend the morning watching the sun slowly coming up over the sea together. Aw, so cute. Emma, most likely to marry a zebra. Polly, least cor... Cor... <laughs> Corporal student, then. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Well, I don't care about Polly. Don't get me wrong, I'm happy I won. But I, I'm the real winner here. One new secret ending in love and new events and new outcomes. Ooh, fine. Yeah. So I ended up with 10 smarts, 10 boldness, 9 creativity, 10 charm, 12 charm, 10 fun, and 5 money. So I ended up with 6 smarts, 5 boldness, 6 creativity, 7 charm, 3 fun, 2 money. Alright. 
Well, thank you guys so much. That's going to be our playthrough of Monster Prom on this channel. Uh, we might live stream it one day on Twitch just for fun um, to get some other endings with some different characters. We'll and, see. And, and do, do the 60 hour version. Or a 60 minute version or something. Yeah. 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 And to do the, or like, full or the spin off. Yeah. No, well, we'll just see, um, depending on how this goes. Anyway, so I want to say thank you guys all so much for watching. Thank you guys for watching the series. It meant a lot to me. So make sure you guys comment, like, and subscribe. Turn on that notification bell. Thank you so, uh, so you guys never miss a video from me. Oh, my bad. Thank you so much to my beautiful, beautiful baby. Yeah, ring the bell. The go ding, 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 ding. <laughs> Who's the only date for me for joining this video? And we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Roll the credits.